I know you're supposed to be dead and all, but you have to look this pissed? Johnny, you said you'd take me out to dinner. And here we are. At Freckle, bitches? Where else would we go? If you lived Somebody's in Newcastle, good? that's like, uh, you know, you the one place everyone takes, like, Asia. It's not like the girlfriends do. Hey, what's up? The Perfect timing. Timing. McDonald's. You boys talk. I'll be right back. I'm not even joking. Whatever. She don't appreciate fine dining. I'm not even joking on that. Now, it's I've fine restaurants, but everyone seems to just take people out, to McDonald's. Tanya's been fucking people in every sense of the word. Not only is she blowing King's bodyguard, Big Tony, but she's fucking Warren Williams, a numbers guy, whenever Tony ain't looking. Now, between Tony and Warren, the only person she isn't leading around by their cock is King. So I'm thinking, we put the hurt on Tanya, we're fucking up the Vice Kings. And she's got an operation in prong court. That's where we'll start. Roll in there and put the murder on anyone you see, customers included. Who wants to die for a blowjob, right? <laughs> when you go for Tanya, be careful. She probably got some muscle in there. Who die you know who I think would die for a blowjob? Um, if anyone's seen, it's a bit of an obscure film to say, but if anyone's seen Hobo for shock, Shotgun, that, fuck you, uh, that corrupt police officer, he pretty much dies, or what? He's a sick fuck. I do recommend going to see it, but if you've got a weak stomach or just hate stupid, like ridiculously stupid films, I wouldn't recommend Hobo with a shotgun, but it's all good fun. Because who comes up with that stuff and why, why does it exist? I highly recommend going to see that if you are a fan of exploitation films like that. Like if you're a fan of like... Uh, Machete by uh, Robert Rodriguez. Like Machete films by Robert Rodriguez. It's all about just this one Mexican federale going around killing people. Killing like... Well, not exactly. He's killing them for a reason, but you know... I'm just seeing it like that because like... Why... Why does it exist? I'm sure of revenge stories have been around since the dawn of time. This one doesn't take itself seriously. And the sequel's even worse in terms of ridiculousness. Oh god damn it, I Alright, where's the... Where I invade that one place. It's cool. Vice Kings ain't gonna never bow down. I ain't. Uh. Oh. Well, so much for Tanya's hired help. Now get your ass over to the whorehouse and drop that chicken head. What's up? Lag. Or a low frame rate. You shouldn't have stuck your nose in our bitch. Ah! 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 Gotta remember to bring out the bitch. Hey, yo, we can't lose. Pay for that. Come What's to people on the lower floor. Fuck them. After you're dead, I'm getting my nut. Ain't getting any further. All right, there's no one through there. Yep, 
He's dead. Uh, is there another guy over there? No, there isn't, but behind them doors. Come on, you baby. Yeah. You know you want some of this. You don't know what you're doing. You're never going bad at it. What's. Mm. Let mom take care of it. Hey, we can't lose this is he? place. Oh, there he is. Ah. Oh, oh. Shit. I don't know why. Don't tell me no one's ever did that when playing like uh, GDA 3. When the first play of that. Wait, what? Damn it! I gotta be on stage. Hey, we can't. No. No chance, woman. There you are. All done. They're all dead. How much is this studio incident gonna set us back? Uh, the incident? I'm sorry. I thought some motherfuckers blew up my shit. I didn't realize it ain't no thing. How? Much. Including the loss of revenue from Aisha's death, I'd say we talking millions. You remind me of Chris Rock. Okay. By how got whiny you are. That owe us. Convince them to hook us up. That takes care of the building. I like Chris That's Rock, but I don't like throw when he some memorial moments. box set. People eat that shit up. That should recoup some of our losses. How's Tanya's side of things? Grip is short, Mr. King. I'm not happy, Anthony. You said she could handle it. It's not her fault, Mr. King. The Saints have been fucking with That's what I'm talking about! Are you gonna let these bitches disrespect us? Everybody calm the fuck down. We ain't gonna start a war every time some motherfuckers act hard. We gotta talk about the Saints. Thank you. Hey, baby. They've taken prawn court. How did this happen? How the fuck you think it happened? Look, we need to get together here and just- What we need is for you to shut the fuck up. You feel me? Yeah. What? Yes, Mr. King. I'll have Monroe put some pressure on the Saints. While they're distracted, it should be easy to take back what's ours. Everything else is business as usual. Understood? Now, this meeting is over. The King has spoken. <laughs> you can feel free to tell us I'm a fucking idiot for saying it. Quote like that. All oh, right. I've got to, you know what? Fuck. I've got time for one more mission. Why not? Why the hell not? And then I'll move on to Arkham, uh, Arkham Asylum. I probably won't get an hour done on Arkham Asylum, but we'll see. I hope they get an hour done on Arkham Asylum, I love that game. Um, I wish a cop saw that. Where is the next Vice King's mission? I told you I'm doing the Vice King's first now. It was originally going to be the Carnalis, but I fucked up on that. Uh, is that it? Or is that a stronghold? Stronghold. Oh shit. There is no... Really? I... What the hell? Oh, I bet you it's one of them stronghold... Not strongholds, uh... Pushbacks I've got to do first. No, no, it can't be. That was Carnalis. What side it was? 
Must be. Oh. I don't know if it's quota time or what, but the cops are leaning hard. Shit's too hot right now. I want you to get off the street. Hold on, what? You're kidding me. Fucking cocksuckers! Change of plans. Looks like the Kings are trying to get back Tanya's old digs as we speak. Get your ass over there and help our boys. You're the only backup they're getting. Otsu. Oh well, that's actually a story-based one, I suppose. Where I came. This is How am I meant to get there? That's ah, screw it. Well, I'll do this and then I'll, I'll call it night because I thought I maybe I had a bit more time to do another mission, but I suppose I haven't. Come on, you son of a bitch. You can't blame me for that. You can't blame me. Got anything on me, boy? Huh? I was wondering because I thought it was that um, fenced off area on the map. Uh, you no, know, if you go where Saints Hideout is in Saints Road 2, that entire area is fenced off. Stay down, before I put you down. We're gonna drop you. Coming back home, baby. Shit. Ah! I almost fucked that up. I hope you're not cash. We got more work to do. Troy just got a tip that Tanya's setting up shop in the old Sunnyvale police station. I talked to Julius, and he gave me the okay to go in with a crew. Now I'm heading back to the church to get strapped. Come over when you're ready. But don't wait too long. We got some murdering to do. Oh, so that was the mission. Alright then. Well, I guess I'll call that a video for Saints Row today, and then I'm going to start and uh, do a bit more Arkham Asylum. Uh, I hope you enjoyed these, this, uh, these few parts. I'm guessing this is about part 5, part 6. Um, I hope you enjoy them. If not, let us know in the comments. If you do like them, feel please. It helps us if you like, like, like the video. Feel free to leave a comment. Subscribe. That is always a good, uh, you know, a good ego booster in a way. But you know, if if you like the video, do it. just you know, feel free to subscribe. Definitely give us leave a like. That helps us a great deal. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video, which I hope will be soon. Goodbye.